Josh and I decided that we're going to buy a house. Our budget and lifestyle mean that it's going to be a tiny house. Today, I'm going to show you the first house. It's called The Green. Really wow. nice. OK. I grew up in Victorian homes. I need the original features. I can't live in a place where they've taken them out. Let's take a look at the first bedroom. Perfect. Vivian's crib. And the floor feels nice and solid. Let's take a look at the second bedroom. I do like the idea of laying out here and staring at that view. I like the original feel to the bathroom. It feels in keeping with the house. This is what it's all about right here. I like this sink. And I think you'll love the upgraded appliances. Yeah, I really do. Everything's kind of like right there for you. Laundry room, that's like a complete and utter steal. That's a delight. The thing about tiny houses, which is really good, is that they're often full of nooks and crannies. So it's not until you go and have a look at them that you realize just how many different surprises there are in the house. You know, they do have a few different secrets. And we're going to call this one the garden. Isn't this so gorgeous? Wow. Wow, this is a great space for a second bedroom. Yeah, this bathroom has some age, but it's fully functional. And to me, it feels oddly spacious. Look at these great countertops. I've never seen wooden style countertop, huh? It's not as updated as you saw in the first place, but it's great fridge. It's nice, yeah, it fits well into the space. Looks like a good space. I feel like there's so many windows. The house has a very light feel. I think one of the biggest surprises for me was how expensive all these houses were. $400,000. Wow. $325,000. $450,000. This home, we're calling the Southwestern. Oh, wow. Wow, look at this. I like what I see so far. There is AC built in. Very nice. And you have the nice high ceilings as well. It really makes a small space feel much bigger. This is a really nice bathroom. It's a brand new kitchen, brand new cabinetry, and upgraded appliances. It's perfect. Whoa! Come and see this room. And you do have custom closets here. The garden has that certain je ne sais quoi. OK, let's do it. Let's buy the garden. It's worth it. <laughs> if we had to give advice to someone else looking for a tiny house, it's get rid of all your old stuff first, first well before you even start thinking about moving. Vivian, can you say tiny house? <laughs> Cheers, everybody. Cheers.